Hi everyone and welcome back to Nikos Guy South Africa. Today we're looking at um, Hot Wheels uh, Premium Collector Sets. The one in front of you, uh, that's the uh, Hot Wheels Track Day Set, case code 979N. But cool, let's get uh, straight into it. So each case contains two sets, and um, as it stands, these sets have already hit. Uh, I think they've been found at Toys R Us and other toy stores, but uh, yeah, they should be found locally already. Awesome. So, uh, this is what the set looks like. Hot Wheels Premium Track Day. You get the Hero Hero Roller, which is like a bus type thing. You get the 8040 Sport Quattro, that's my favorite. Lamborghini Ascenza SUV 12. And then the last one, the Sabre Mercedes C9. So that's what you get. And if you look at the back, that's what that looks like. Awesome. So I think this time around, let's see if we can uh, yeah, open it. Because it's uh, cool out the box, right? So, out of the box. Yeah, very cool display set. Cool, I want to get them loose even. Let's see. Got some fitted with these uh, rubber bands here at the bottom. Let's see if it's uh yeah, okay, not too bad. Just without uh letting them fall there at the back. With a bunch of rubber bands here at the bottom, but I think yeah, we can still look at it. Cool, so lots and lots of rubber bands. So I'm wondering, like, if you like keep these packaged right, like, probably these um, rubber bands will perish over time anyway, so they're gonna probably. You know, become loose within the packets, I'm guessing. That's just the theory. I mean, these premium display cases haven't been around that for, for that long. So we haven't seen the effects of time yet, right? So cool. So that's the Sabre Mercedes C9. Yeah, cool looking race car. Awesome. Cool. So that's the first one. And the uh, second one. So 
And I think I'm going to split the set and I'll keep the, you know, the audio for myself. It kind of just makes sense. <laughs> Second one, Lamborghini Senza. Cool. That's very nice. This is a shiny supercar. That's awesome. It's the second one, and then the third one, my favorite. Guessing not the traditional favorite, but it's definitely my favorite. Is the uh, Audi Quattro, and I'll compare this for you to the uh, the other Audi Quattros that's come out recently because I have them on hand. Cool, so this is what that looks like. That's cool. So they're doing different variations of these stripes. Cool. Lots of details, so that's cool. And you can just grab the other two quick and then I'll show you. Okay, cool. So here we go. So this is this box one that is uh can't even recall. So that was in a single card, cool. And then this one was in the two pack. So cool. So I think these two are very close. Ah, oh, and they're doing something with the numbers, one, two, three. Okay, that's interesting. First, second, third premium. Cool. I don't know if that was on purpose, but that's cool. Awesome. So those are the three premiums, Audi Quattros, so far, as far as I know. That's awesome. And then the last one, the, uh, the order. Okay, cool. So this is the uh, Euro Hauler. Cool. These rubber bands missing around, but cool. That's what it uh, looks like. And yeah, you can fit some cars in the back. Cool. Awesome. And that's it. Thank you for watching. Cheers.